Time right now is 741. And from the streets of Philly to Wall Street is the premise behind a new movie. And we're talking with the director of Changing the Game. He's right here in our studios right now. He's joining us coming up after the break. The new film, Changing the Game, chronicles the life of a young African-American who spends his childhood on the streets of North Philadelphia. But as an adult, he ends up going to an Ivy League school and ultimately lands a dream job on Wall Street. But surviving the Wall Street game will take everything he learned growing up on the dangerous streets. And joining us is the film's writer-director, Rel Dowdell. What's up, my thank man? You, thank you. Good to see you. Thank you. Good to see you. Talk honored. a little bit more about the synopsis, man. I've heard a lot of good buzz yes. about this, and it took a while to put together. First, the synopsis and the length it took to get this on well, big I wanted, screen. I want it to be like a galvanizing story about showing a young African-American male overcome great odds, mm -hmm. really, because mm -hmm. that message right now is paramount in our community. Mm -hmm. And I wanted to show that the African-American struggle could be anybody's struggle. Right. This young man perseveres a lot of obstacles, so anybody, no matter what the race or culture, can relate to that story. And as you said, it took me seven years to get this film, to raise money for it, to complete it, to get distribution. The road was, was unequivocally arduous. Wow, to say the least. I'm sure it was. Now, I'm this sure it was. Shot Oh, uh, most of it was shot in Philadelphia? All of it. All of it? The whole thing in what Philadelphia. What was that like shooting here? It saves you a lot of money because Philadelphia is kind of an eclectic environment. It can, it can pose for other places. So I used Wall Street locations, Philadelphia. Thailand mm -hmm. locations, Philadelphia. London locations, Philadelphia. And North Philly nice. locations, obviously, right. Philadelphia. So I used the whole, pretty much the whole world right here in the Philadelphia environment, which is... And you got the peeps to come to you. You got Tony Todd involved. Tony Todd. From Candyman fame. Talk about the cast a little bit. Awesome cast, eclectic cast, multiracial cast. Uh, Irma P. Hall hmm. from mm -hmm. Soul Food and mm -hmm. Lady Killers. Uh, Sean Riggs is my lead actor. Great. The next Denzel, I think he really is. He's really? I think he's that good. Got major skills. I think he's that mm. good. He's really that good. Suzanne Douglas, who's in a film called Jason's Lyric. Uh, sure. And uh, Kirk Sticky Fingers Jones plays a key role. Dennis L.A. White. I really wanted to show that African American films can be bigger than just relating to one experience. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So uh, the cast is, is multicultural, and I think that's probably one of the main reasons why my film was able to get distribution on a theatrical level because it appeals to more than one demographic. Because that is a difficult process to it's, get these films dis uh, distributed these days, isn't it? It takes a lot of support. Like a lot of people here in the area supported me, like like yourselves, obviously, giving mm -hmm. the word here about the film. But local businessman Tom Webster, a uh, guy named Willie Johnson invested in my film. As you know, Mike Dennis, real sure, black. Mike, sure. My good friends, Todd Rose, Marty Floyd, helped put the event on last week at the Art Museum. So it takes it takes a village to raise an independent film, if right. I might use that. No so. doubt about it. Now, yeah. in this film, there's uh, some correlation between the growing up in Philadelphia mm. and having to use those skills on Wall Street. What's mm -hmm. that relationship there? Because in, in North Philadelphia, the young man grows up on 8th and Butler, which mm -hmm. is a, which is a sure. notorious neighborhood mm -hmm. in the 80s. Mm -hmm. And he realized that once he gets to Wall Street, it's more of a mental game. Right. To survive North Philadelphia, it's more of a physical situation, your physical brawn. But to get to Wall Street, it's more of a, fi a mental moxie, something you have to learn to play the Machiavellian game. That's what he does. Hello. He learns the Machiavellian game of right. survival from his friends. So. And you've got a little twist in it. There's a mysterious mm. gift that we can't you obviously give away mm -hmm. that help, kind of helps him along the way or it it plays is, a prominent role, right? And, and that's, I'm glad you brought that up because I'm a big fan of Alfred Hitchcock. Like, that's one of my film mm -hmm. school. When I went to film school, he was my, one of my idols because Great. he always had something going on, a twist. And I said, how come an African-American film can't use some of these same twists and be suspenseful? Okay. So I wanted to put some element. I have a surprise ending. Like oh, the nice. Sixth Sense. Yeah. Nice, you nice, know, I remember nice. when that film came out, the big deal about that film was you got to see the surprise ending. So I said, you know what? I want to have a surprise ending for my film, too, that galvanized the audience. So people say, I got to see that movie maybe more than once, maybe right. twice, to Ooh, see what I missed. I got some goosebumps <laughs> up in here right now. What happens when the game changes? Check this man's film yes. out. And please don't don't buy bootlegs of my film. Yeah, right. That's, that's just ruining the industry. Please. Come on now. And, and make sure your ticket stub says changing the game. If you buy a ticket online for your friends, but make sure you go open the weekend. Open the weekend for these films is critical for independent films. It is. That way they can survive. And like my film opens the door for other films too to get out there in the future. Keep Seven doing what years you're of, doing. of work. Yes, yes, indeed. Indeed. yes, man. I feel Thank it. I feel, it. I feel Come it. Come back and see it. I'm honored. You feeling it? Yes, my man. Thank, Thank you so you, much. Changing the game opens Thank tomorrow you. at Limited Run at the AMC Cherry Hill. Good luck, my friend. Yes. Thank you so much. Keep Thank it going. You. Keep it going.